Now to the latest on fighting in the Middle East. Israel has ordered a complete siege of the Gaza Strip. The government releasing this video of buildings being destroyed in airstrikes. Israel stopped supplies of food, water and electricity to the Gaza Strip. In a speech to his country, Prime Minister Benjamin Netanyahu says the offensive has just started warning citizens that we have hard days coming. At this hour, we know at least 900 people have been killed in Israel and 680 killed in Gaza. Thousands of others are injured. The U.S. State Department says nine Americans are among the dead and more than 100 hostages have been taken. At this point, their fate is not known. It is uh, by far the, the, uh, the worst day in Israeli history. Never before have so many Israelis been killed by one single thing let alone enemy activity on one day. And if you're Americans and want to compare this to something in American history, then this could be a 9-11 and a Pearl Harbor wrapped into one. President Biden has reportedly spent the day speaking with allies and meeting with the top national security team.